stones, words, and a pure rowing mass, agony, pain, hate, prejudice, bravery, and courage. Girl and three others were more chaos. Hi, my name is Alex. Well, 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 look who didn't get into the GAPE program for the so-called genius. So how does it feel to be ordinary for once? Bye, so have a nice day, Alex. Okay, class, turn to page 240. Um, hey, Alex, can I use your book? I kind of forgot mine at home. Um, sure, here you go. That sounds so... Bye, Alex. What have you done, Alex? That book cost a lot of money. It's not my fault. Sandy did it. You shouldn't blame others for things you did. Sticks and stones may break my bones, but words will never hurt me. I'm constantly behind a Pierrot mask, trying to be happy, but it's all fake. Who's here, little Miss A plus? How about you just go disappear? No one cares if you go. How about you just go die? Help, help, I'm stuck. Maybe that's what's best for me. Maybe that's what's going to make everyone happy. In my eyes, my future is great. Oh, it's her again. So when are you going to go plan this suicide? Look, you know what? I've got enough of you guys. Since no one's going to stand for me, I'm going to stand on by myself. I'm all right. I'm all right. Pain in her is really something I don't mind. If what if it is what causes me to smile, then it's really fine by me. I fall repeatedly, but I get up from that circus right next door while bouncing Pierrot. You, you know what? I really don't mind until now. And guess what? Making you happy is over. I've thrown away my mask, and now looking at the lying Pierrot, it's vanished into the void. 
Six stones, words, and Piero mask. Agony, pain, hate, bravery, and courage? I said because no one stepped for me. It didn't have to be like that. Somebody could have made a difference, but just like the lying Piero, who just wanted to make everyone happy, just disappeared into the void. We want to go back in time to 1860. Mr. Pie is not free. Now time for an entertaining presentation. We are instructors at Kara it's karate time. Kids tease us because of the name at our karate center. Now we're going to tell you how to act when you're bullied. I hope you all learned a good... A good lesson today. Now back to the Civil War. The crying name is pretty weird. <laughs> Class is over. We'll continue tomorrow. Oh, <laughs> Sorry, I forgot my keys here. What? Uh, are kids still talking about our name? Yes, they are. Well, this calls for a payback. It's karate time isn't so bad. Got my keys. Now I can. Wow, I didn't know Monopoly could be so rewarding. No, Monopoly's so stupid. Ow, you're just upset that you lost. Hey, why are they here? Someone made, wrote a note that our company name, It's Karate Time, is stupid. Which one of you wrote that note? How about we bully them all, since they're not telling the truth? Yeah. <laughs> Ow! No! We've done our job! It didn't feel too good when we got bullied. Maybe I should tell Mr. Pie that I wrote that note about him and apologize. Go. Mr. Pie, I wrote a note about how you're a freakazoid and that your classroom is weird. I'm sorry. It's quite alright, Byron. You know. No, bullying isn't nice, but I'm kind of sh strange and different. My classroom is just the way I express myself now. Let's f find a way to make the class travel back to the 1860s. Ha 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 ha.